I'm here today with Daryl Hodges from Hello. Dynamite. Uh, good morning, Daryl. It's, uh, it's great for you to be here at Lake Katlov with the World Carp Classic Junior event. Uh, it's the first time that you know, this event's been going and uh, delighted to have you and Dynamite Bates involved as one of our event partners. Yep, yeah, it's, it's great to be here. I mean, obviously, it's such a short space of time since you mentioned you were going to do that, and yeah, here we are. Yeah, it's, it's kind of incredible just to think that five months ago this was just an idea, um, and now here we are actually in the midst of the event. Uh, we're just going into day two of the competition. Yep. Um, and I think it, it's really interesting to see the different countries and, and how the juniors are reacting to what's going on. Yeah, I mean, obviously, uh, there's a few guys, I spoke to a few guys this morning, but I'm going to have a good walk around the lake if I can make it. Yeah. And um, yeah, there, there's a few people a little bit disappointed they've not got a few more fish. And I think I'm a little bit surprised there's not more fish because it looked perfect last night. But um, I guess with all the rods going in and it's, they're going to retreat a little bit, but hopefully the fish will show today and tonight. I think there'll be a lot of fish caught. Well, that certainly seems to be happening because this morning the fish are starting to kind of... Yeah come out all over the place, which, uh, yeah, it's going to be exciting to see how the event unfold so unfolds. The Italians have five, I think, now, Ricardo? Six. Six now. Yeah. Okay, so it's changing all the time, yeah? Yeah, and I think okay. they, they, they've got another one actually on at the moment right. as well. Right, okay, so, okay. Yes, it's, uh, but they've come, there's so many fish that have come in such a short space yeah. of time. Yeah, yeah. So, but it's, it's great to have a company like Dynamite Baits involved in the World Carp Classic and subsequently the World Carp Classic Junior event. Yeah, yeah. I mean, when you mentioned it, obviously, we're involved with the, uh, the main World Carp Classic when we first met two, three years ago, maybe now. It was something we really wanted to get involved in, and I've got to say, it's been brilliant for us. And uh, when you mentioned the Junior one, it's brilliant to be involved in, you know, something for the kids and something for a worthy charity. So, you know, Dynamite's really proud to, to get involved in stuff like that and help it happen. Well, I think the thing is, I mean, one of the exciting things about this event is whoever wins this competition, uh, the, the juniors from that country will go through to the actual World Cup Classic yeah. this year. And, it, and, and that's going to be just such an amazing experience because I think most of these kids have never probably experienced anything like this before. So to go and experience the main event at somewhere like Medine or Bolsina, it'll blow them away, it'll blow them away. Well, I think the thing is, I mean, where we've got so many different countries, I mean, the bait that, that Dynamite actually make, uh, how many countries do you actually distribute bait in now? We distribute to officially around about 27 or 28 different countries. Um, but we're, I think we're actually for sale in around about 32 or 33. So I'm not sure how that happens, but it's something to do with a great market, I guess. Um, but yeah, it's uh, busy, busy times making big shipments to some of those countries. And some countries are very difficult to get big shipments into. Well, I think uh, one of the exciting things about Dynamite is, is when you, uh, and having been to the factory, to see it's not just a que question of throwing a few products together and no. mixing, it's, it's really good quality bait. Yeah, yeah definitely. And uh, everyone who comes to the factory, the anglers, you know, you can't help but see how impressed they are. And I think even people who don't know too much about Dynamite or are used to fishing with other brands, they come to the factory and they're all very impressed with how professional it all is and how organized and, and just yeah, the thought and the, the, the attention to detail and the care that goes into it, you know, the, the quality control as such. And uh, speaking to, you know, Christoph, uh, the winners, yeah. they were telling the guys, the, the English team have not been to the factory just yet, but uh, they're just, yeah, they were just buzzing. So it's good to hear that when they come up, so. Yeah, well, the thing is, it's almost like a science lab that there are, all the flavors and mixtures yep. and, the, yep. and the testing tanks and everything. Yep. So it really is something quite special, but, uh, Anyway, um, for the guys that win, is there a message that, that you'd like to convey to them? Uh, to the guys that win the event, then, well, enjoy it. And obviously, whoever wins it will have done very well. And I think uh, good luck to them, whoever does win. And, yeah, look forward to seeing them at Medine. And, uh, yeah, they'll, they'll obviously get some dynamite as a prize. So hopefully they'll put it to good use. Absolutely. With Daryl for the moment, thank you, thank you very much. I'll see you soon. Thank you. Cheers.